Now it's time for a challenge. Uh, right now, the turn function in this program is uh, it goes off of time. It would be handier if instead of time it went by degrees. So that if I put in 90 degrees, my robot turned 90 degrees. What this would entail is changing time to degrees and then multiplying by some number to get the the right amount of time based on the number of degrees. So what you're going to have to do is play around with this uh, number. This, maybe you try four and then you run it and see what it does and then you try five and you're going to have to call something. I would just use one of these, not both of them. Something that's going to be easy for you to tell. So that might be 90 degrees or that might be 180 degrees but something that's going to be very easy for you to tell if it's turning the way you want and then just keep toying with this number until you get it to work. If you're like me you could dig out the ruler and the protractor and do some very fine measurements and be very meticulous and uh, even do some uh, regressions to try and figure out what that number should be um, as close as possible but you can also just use trial and error.